Answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the magician persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Lecture you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right, I'm gonna stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strengths born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills too. This is all part of our deal. Got it? I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? messages to each other with that thing, right? I want in too. So, I'm gonna have to ask you to type for me. <sighs> Let's turn in for the night. That's not good.
Hey, are you listening? Pay attention! Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. Just come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Actually... Hey! the clinic that the chief mentioned. Now, how can we get them to give us some medicine? Well, I guess that's the only choice we have. We'll just have to go for it. All right, let's step in. Well, to the exam room. In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. I'm gonna prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Actually, I still need to restock those. So let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or a bitter one? How about a stinky one then? Just kidding, there's no such pill. All right, why don't we stop beating around the bush? You're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me, hmm? You're one of those patients with an ulterior motive, huh? What's the world coming to? I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays too, huh? Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. But only medication that will help you recover your health. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest. And you don't look like you'll be any trouble. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by anytime. Great! 
It's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? I wonder what you're going to use the medicine for. Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. Okay, which one? Want that one? Thanks. That should work. Here you go. Take care. able to get our hands on some decent stuff if this door really has model guns. Well, we can leave that for tomorrow. Let's go home. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> 